here in the corner and work my way up. I take the 45 degrees with the point down, place it in the floor, and squeeze just a little bit, not to get it on the floor, and then leave that angle and straight up. So I have a good seal all the way down. The next part as I come across, so I start at the top, do the same thing there. Now I've got a bleed over, so what I'm going to do is take my finger, Simply press down, close up any gaps that I have, and then wipe up any of the excess that I have there. Now the next step is go across the way. What I do here is I make sure that the tip is completely clean. Place the tip into the corner. I squeeze a little bit so I see some of it come out. And I have a steady pressure going all the way across. And what happens is the tip will seal everything off. Occasionally you're going to have a little bit of odor and you'll need to run your finger into the corner. And what that does is give it a nice uh, peel all the way across. So you just come back and touch up any part that you need. And what I do is wipe off any of the excess that I have. So I'll go in, get my touches. The secret to this is once it's set, I'm going to leave it alone. Seal off and push in the cock all the way through. And then you just go back and touch it with any errors that you may have. Like so. What I do here in the corners, again, is take the tip, have an even part there, take the tip again, push it into the corner, come back in, and wipe up anything any access that you have. 